Hello friends, this is Sandra here from Woolifier.com and WhimsterDreamsClipart.com. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you a really handy tool here in Canva and it's the styles. You find the styles in the menu on the left and it has this palette here. And this is a really handy feature if you are uncertain how to color your things, what fonts to use that are looking great together and such things. So happy times, now we have help. So if you like my channel, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe, it really helps. And if you uh, love to learn more about Canva, please come and join our Facebook group as well. You find a link down below in the description. Now, let's get started and I will show you this feature. It's super simple, so no stressy stressy. I just opened a template here in Canva to show you the features. So let's go to styles. And up here in this menu here, you find all the colors and fonts. And if you have a brand kit, you find it up here. And if you have selected or you have uh, customized color palettes, they will show here as well. And this is a really handy feature as if you are creating branded pictures or branded images, you just click here and the font will be activated directly. Uh, the same goes with color you see here if you just shuffle here you can get branded color variations in a heartbeat and this saves time if you don't have any branding colors or you're creating something you know not for your company or anything you can uh, scroll down here and find the trending uh, color palettes and font combinations so let's see here if I find something that I like I like this brown, of course. So let's try it out and see what's happening here. So I just click on this and you see everything changes and you can get several different color combinations just by shuffling these around. Or if I don't like it, I can go to this one and just click it and see what's happening here. And let's try another one. This I find very cute as well, just to see what's happening, you know. So you just uh, click them to shuffle. So this is an easy, easy, easy way if you have, you know, lack of inspiration or you find it hard to combine colors and fonts. Uh, so this is my little tip for you. If you like this tutorial, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Uh, and in that way you get notifications every time that I upload a new video. And see you in the next video. Bye bye.